Hello, my name is William Davenport, and I'll be singing the tenor solos in the Beethoven concert. And I'm Melissa Kornacki, and I'll be singing the alto solo in the Beethoven concert. And we're here to briefly talk about why you should come see us sing this great concert. Uh, Beethoven 9 and the Emperor Concerto are both two pieces that are just so well known and so beautiful, it's impossible not to get wrapped up in them as you sit and watch. And You know, they're totally accessible to anybody off the street, whether they like classical music or they don't can really just come in and have a moving concert experience. Yeah, I think the first time I heard this piece was when I was nine, and I saw Die Hard with Bruce Willis, and I thought that was really cool. So um, as I grew up and started studying music, then I realized, oh, okay, it's Beethoven 9, and then I really wanted to sing it. Um, this is my third time singing it, and the first time was with my college choir, um, and now, of course, I'm going to be doing the solo parts, and I realized that um, as many times as you hear it, it's different every time. It's not just, you know, people, I know people on the street are going to go, oh, you know, Beethoven 9, I've heard that a million times, but as we both know, being a concert artist, that um, you come see Ed and he does the Messiah completely different. I'll, I'll never sing the Messiah the same again, and I've heard that from a bunch of other people. They'll never do it. So um, we haven't really worked with Ed yet on Beethoven, but we know it's going to be completely different. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ed always brings his own unique vision to the pieces that we work on, so it's always a pleasure to work with him. And this is actually my first time uh, singing Beethoven 9, so I really can't wait to get started with him. Um, yeah, it's it's a really difficult piece. Um, I, I know that in the chorus parts, um, the octave jumps all the time, there's lots of tempo changes, there's uh, different parts, just in the fourth movement alone. I mean, his solo is amazing, so you should come see him sing, just his solo. Um, and then Robert Cantrell's solo is amazing, and um, I'm sure Janice, when she's here, her part is really difficult. It's yeah. all the way up on B all the time. And uh -huh. and really the exciting part is when all these you know individual parts kind of come together and have this huge climax with the orchestra and chorus, and it's really just impossible not to be moved at that point in the piece. So, so, if you'd like to come and see us, we are going to be performing at 8 p.m. in Friedberg Hall on March 26th. Friedberg Hall is at the Peabody Conservatory in downtown Baltimore.